Why would it be important to talk about our defects of character? Because authenticity is not the only thing we need in our church and in our culture and our families. We also need grace. See, if we're gonna up the level of authenticity, if we're gonna deepen the level of authenticity, we have to deepen our level of grace. Because people, I personally believe that our greatest need is to be reconciled with our creator. Every one of us deeply needs to know that we're loved just as we are by our creator. And we are. Jesus Christ did that for us on the cross. And we can actually be totally accepted by him. He saw our flaws and still wanted to die for us. That's why he died for us, so we could have a relationship even with our flaws. But we also need to have an experience of being accepted by the people around us. And the only way that's gonna happen is if we increase our quotient of grace. Now how do you become more gracious? You have to be honest with your own flaws and realize you're actually not that much better than the people around you that you're angry at or that you're critical of or that you're gossiping about or that you're not forgiving. And most of us, when it comes right down to it, actually think we're better than the people around us. By looking at our own flaws and realizing God wants to work on those helps us be gracious with other people. In Romans chapter 15 talks about we the strong ought to bear with the failings of the weak. I'm giving you a practical way to do that. 